Hello, I'm David Peters, the new Dean of the Faculty of Health. It is a pleasure to speak to you as I begin in my new role. I'd like to take this opportunity to introduce myself and my vision for the faculty. Along with a passion for advancing health equity, I bring to this position three decades of leadership experience at Johns Hopkins University and the World Bank and in various international organizations and NGOs. Most of my research, practice and teaching has been interdisciplinary. I focused on strengthening health systems by using data, engaging key stakeholders and building capacity to address issues of poverty and health in low and middle income countries, largely in sub-Saharan Africa and Asia. It was York's people that initially attracted me here with their ambition to make positive impacts, not just in scholarship, but in society from local to global levels. The Faculty of Health's principles and values grounded in social justice, equity, diversity, and inclusion, and explicitly tackling racism, decolonization, and other causes of discrimination, these align squarely with my own values. For many reasons, I'm delighted to be back in Canada. Since I've been away, this country has experienced major social transformation, driving a new awareness of justice and health equity issues. The Truth and Reconciliation Commission, for example, and its calls to action provide a basis for learning and progress that is missing in so many countries, including in the US. Canada's health system is also at a crossroads. That provides opportunity as we are ready for transformational change at home while being part of a highly interdependent world in need of more effective, fair, and accountable global institutions and processes. Change works better when people are truly involved, when there is evidence to inform and a willingness and ability to learn. I am confident that our faculty is ready to contribute and lead in these ways. We will continue to draw from all of our disciplines, broadening and deepening our commitments for local impact, while expanding international partnerships and activities for global learning and results. At heart, our broad mission is very clear and our tagline sums it up very simply, keeping people healthier longer. Now, to achieve this, we must use all of our capabilities and work from micro to macro, from biologic and metabolic pathways to the health of individuals, families, communities, and nations, and protecting the planet. By reinforcing and building on this strong foundation, I believe that we can create an even greater impact over the coming years. I invite you as alumni and friends of the faculty to join me on this bold journey. I welcome your ideas, suggestions, and active participation in helping to advance our mission. There are countless opportunities to engage.